Instructions. Mouse. Well, thank you for that insight. I'm sure this will really help. Hello ladies and gentlemen and welcome to something a little bit different from usual. Uh, I wasn't entirely sure what to play, so I figured I saw Zootopia recently and that film was pretty cool. So let's go look for some random Flash games online and see what we find. I found this. I'll probably play a few games in this. We'll just sort of mix it up a bit. Come join Nicholas Wilde and Judy Hopps in a rather angry looking Flash. I'm guessing he just found out his coffee went cold. And by just, I mean probably a few hours ago. Let's give this investigation mischief a go. Level 1, don't get caught. Uh, what am I supposed to do? Click. What? I... what? I, I don't understand what I'm doing. Hey, I'm... Licking a lollipop? What? Am I supposed to just hold the button down until... Oh, I'm supposed to wait till Flash isn't looking, I guess? Why? What did Flash do? Is this... are we clear? I, I don't understand. Oh no, Sad Bunny! I, I was caught by who? I don't understand. There's so much going on and no, no one's telling me anything and now they're sad and now I'm sad too. But at least Flash is happy. So that's okay. Kind of. I guess. I, I'm moving on to a different game. This is... I don't understand what's going on. Why are all these games for girls? Guys like the film too. And what exactly makes this a game for a girl, as opposed to just a video game. Anyway... Welcome to Zootopia Easter Mission! I know it's a little late for Easter, but... I, I don't know, screw it. Easter eggs are hidden somewhere in the city. We need to solve the puzzle to find out the exact location. If only detective work with this easy. Thought that I would know either way. <laughs> it tells me where to put it. <laughs> oh, brilliant. Oh. This is 10 out of 10. The best game I've ever played. I mean, who wants, you know, a challenge with a puzzle? I mean, look at this. It's already really simple. But just to make sure it's not too difficult. We're going to tell you where the pieces go, because, after all, this is a game for girls. So clearly, they're going to have to make it extra easy. My god, this is stupid. <laughs> oh, I wonder where this goes. Oh, here, apparently. Oh, that goes there. <laughs> I'm a real detective now. See, I did it. It wasn't on my own, but I did it! So apparently we've got an easter egg hidden behind a tram and somewhere on the roof of this building over here. We have to find 20 eggs. These are hidden in this image. Can you guess... Can you guess where? Grammar! Who needs it when it's a game for girls? Seriously. <laughs> no effort was put into this at all. They just slapped on some famous characters to get some people to play it. Oh, how brilliantly stupid. Hurry up, we don't have much time left. Oh, shut up. You can stare at me, blinking. Don't don't flutter your eyelids at me, huh? Flattery will get you nowhere with me, fake Judy. <laughs> Wait, this is the image that the eggs are hidden in. I thought they'd just put petals or something over this image so that they wouldn't get a copyright thing. But to be honest, I don't think they care at this point. These are hidden eggs, are they? Oh my word, whoever hid these is some sort of Easter genius. 
Oh, Miss M Chief Bogo, you've got a you've got a little something in your um. Your, your, here, let me get that for you. Uh, you, um, I've forgotten the bear's name. Uh, I know Mr. Big over here. I forgot the bear's name. I'm afraid the polar bear, of course. But he's got something in his hair too. I mean, that was probably the best hidden egg because it's the same color as it. It's a similar color to him. Other than that, these are all terrible. <laughs> At least, uh, at least Clawhauser seems quite happy about his little egg surprise on his little nose. His adorable little nose. Oh, uh, you, you've got something there on your nose too. Um, that looks like it's about to crush those... I think those are mice over there. It's quite difficult to tell because I'm a distance from this thing. Uh, ignore that. <laughs> Pretend you didn't see that. That's a person's name. Uh... <laughs> Nice eyebrows, Nick. <laughs> oh no, those were your eyelids. Never mind. Oh, jeez. Well, that was really easy. Great, you found all of them. Now we have to go to the next location. Hurry up. Oh, shut up. I don't know why you can't do this. Can you guessed? Hmm. Interesting. Can you guess where the other 20 eggs are hidden? Well, I, I can give it a go, but I'll be honest. Already, I am stumped. Hurry up. We don't have much time left. Right, I'm back. Sorry I disappeared. Uh, sister came downstairs quickly. Uh, right, let's... Uh, what was I doing? Oh, yes. Finding these near impossible to find eggs. I'd be going faster, but I don't have much space for my mouse like, <laughs> to uh, move about. I'm on a very tiny little uh, IKEA table thing, which uh, is designed to put your laptop on and such. Oh, great. I found them all. But the mission's not over. Oh, no. What next? Oh, there's still a lot of work to do. Great. Anyway, what was I saying? Oh, yeah, I've got this tiny little IKEA table, which I think they call Dave. Uh, which probably isn't spelt the normal way. If I can find it, I'll put a picture up. But, uh, yeah, that's what I've got my mouse on and a keyboard. Just so I can uh, record properly. My setup's a bit weird. We, we need to sort the eggs. Don't catch those who have chicken. Chicken what? Chicken pox? I don't think eggs can get chicken pox. I mean, uh, Judy. Jesus, how are you an officer of the law when you can't... Basic... You can't even talk properly. I, I don't... Uh, whatever, fine. I'll catch the eggs. How am I going to tell if they've got chicken? Is, is chicken some sort of disease? That is a chick, not a chicken. But, you know what, fine. I'll just let the chicken fall to its death, break into the furnace that is directly beneath us. Why is there a furnace beneath us? Because fuck them, that's why. I don't give a fuck. Oh shit, I caught a chicken. Oh fuck. Sorry, I'm swearing a lot all of a sudden. And this is the most docile game you could possibly play. Uh... Oh my word, so... Why? Why? Why would someone do this? I mean, what? I mean, sure, if the, if this is like your first game you've ever made and you're just like, hey, I, I want to take this film, I really like this film, and I, I want to make some really simple games just to practice making a game, and then fine. But why would you have to label it as games for girls? Is that your branding? Or do you actually think girls are so stupid that this th this is okay? Because it, it's not. It's, it's not, really. This game is so stupid. And here I am. Like, what, it, what time is it? It's half eleven at night, and I'm playing this. What has my life become? Oh! Oh, it's my life as a success, because I did it. I did it. Oh, there's one more job. One more job, and it's finally over. Pe 
Paint the eggs. Oh, God. Paint the eggs as you like them. Don't forget to have fun. I can clearly see that this this important mission was incredibly important. Like, I'm not going to talk about what happened in the film or anything because... Oh, I can put a bow on it. Oh, I can change the colour in its place by clicking repeatedly. You know what? Let's go for this this sort of reddish-pink colour. I, I can't quite tell if it's pink or red. Oh, I can change this thing. Uh, yeah, that'll do. Here you did... Uh, there, oh, there you go, buddy. You, you dit. You fucking dit. It again. Happy Easter. Why? Just... Why? We are sure that by now you know that Judy Hopps is the best and the most funny police officer on GamesKids.com. And today, dear friends, we are able to see a new interesting and fun game from the Zootopia Games category, in which you will have the chance to meet with Judy. In this new awesome game, your mission will be to help Judy Hopps be the best police officer there is, which will not be very easy. <laughs> it's anything like the last game, yes it will. Because you will see that if you are not careful and concentrated, you know, like orange juice, unless you're referring to concentrating, which is the action of concentrating. I don't, I don't think a person could be concentrated. Actually, maybe they can. You know what? If you mashed me into a paste, I don't know. You can't, I don't even know what from... What's the difference between normal orange juice and concentrated? I don't even know. <laughs> you will not be able to catch the bad guys soon enough, and so they will escape your pursuit. You will have to be very careful and fast, which is not easy at all. Yeah, you've said that. You said it's not easy twice now. But we are sure that you will catch the bad guys in every level of the game, which means that you will gain a lot of points, which will make you the best player of the game. Have fun. Oh, God. Oh, God. Why is this in the tiny little corner? Is this an actual... Okay, so it looks like this is an actual game by Disney. Um, that's a... Uh, I don't know if that's a good start or not. Um, hello? <laughs> I guess it really isn't a good start. Budum tish. <laughs> Get it? Because I can't start the game. I wonder what they've got on the website. Maybe I can play it on the actual Disney website. Let's give that a go. Can I start the game now? Haha! <laughs> now it's a good start. And the sound is off? No, I just have my sound turn right down on my headphones. Oh, jeez. <clears throat> oh, pardon me. Sorry. Hear that. You are Officer Judy Hopps at the Zootopia Police Department on the tra <clears throat> on the tail of a thief. To jump over or slide under obstacles, press or swipe up or down. If you hit anything, you lose a star, which is kind of the opposite of GTA, because you're the officer this time. I wonder if anyone's going to do a GTA Zootopia mod, because I'd play the heck out of that. I really would, but I'd have to buy GTA 5 on my PC first. I'm not sure it can quite handle that. Anyway. <clears throat> If you lose three stars, you're off the chase, and the thief will get away. Good luck. Well, it's a better description than the one on the other website. Up and down, guys. That's all i got to do. Wish me luck. Oh. 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 Shit. Already. 
off to a good start, clearly. Oh, oh no. <laughs> well, at least this game's more of a challenge than the last one. Uh, oh god. I was going to say something at the beginning of this, but... Uh, oh yes, this game is already better than the last one. It's uh, It seems like it's actually tried to be a game, as opposed to... I, I don't even know what that was. It was... It was trying to be other games. Uh, slide through the gate! Woo! Oh wait, that's in my way. I, I thought that was background. <laughs> You score 297 meters. Better luck next time. You know what? We'll, we'll give that one more go, because I started off pretty poorly there. I'm sure I can do better. Catch that weasel! Or was it catch the weasel? I missed it. I wasn't really looking. I get the feeling that this is already a mobile game. And uh, they've just sort of got a really simple thing on the computers, because the people uh, use computers too? I don't know. Just something to fill in their website with, I guess. Come here, you weasel. Get back here with that stuff, which I'm not going to say what it is, because spoilers. I mean, if you're here, you've probably seen the film already. If if not, go see it. The film's really good. I absolutely love that film. I've already pre-ordered the DVD, to be honest. Uh. This music, though, is fantastic. It's great. Officer Judy Hopps, able to leap tall buildings, not at all, apparently. Yeah, that that's enough of that. Thanks. How do I how do I get out of full screen? How do how do I get out of here? <laughs> Let me go. I want to be free. Oh, there we go. Zootopia Nick Wild Messi. I'm sure this will be... Oh, God. Oh, God. It's so cute. Uh... What the fuck have you done? What? What? What possible situation could cause this. What? I don't even know what half of this is. What is this? Is this a bra hanging from your arm? Nick, what have you been up to? You... I don't... Ugh. Okay, at least the bra's... Oh, it's not a bra, it's... What the heck is this? Tweezers. Here, let me just pull this thing that's sticking out of you out it, does this hurt at all I mean any other reaction than giving me that what even is that look Are you trying to be seductive what what is this supposed to be a seductive look or are you just feeling really sassy right now I don't Look, I'm already cleaning you. Can you not make this more uncomfortable? Can you? Oh, I click once and it's done. Ugh. Nick, could you not make this any more uncomfortable for me? Please, it's already... already weird. Oh, great. Now he's wet. Dry off, you dirty fox. <laughs> I can't believe I just said that. Uh, let me wash off this indiscernible splat mark? Or is that tufts of fur from the other animal you killed? <sighs> and now I have to brush your fur. Yeah, I really can't see... I just have to hold it here. I don't have to move my mouse at all. And it does it. I really can't imagine Nick letting some random bloke comb, mm, brush his fur. This is, especially with that look, completely solid. I mean, I mean, he's not moving. That don't take that out of context. 
<laughs> just not moving, unblinking, just that one look. Oh, uh, uh, I'm out, I'm out. Fuck that. Right, uh, I'm going to finish this off with one final game. This one's called Nick and Judy Kissing. I'm pretty sure it's exactly what you're going to expect it to be. This one's for all the shippers out there. Myself included. Shh. Tell no one. Oh, the art changes completely. And oh my. Oh no. <laughs> you change clothes and every... <laughs> for Nick. <laughs> that is the sassiest little creature I have ever seen. <clears throat> they change clothes. And what the hell was Flash holding? And that was very quick for a sloth. I mean, hey, I, I shouldn't be so prejudiced against sloths. I mean, a sloth can be quick, of course. But clearly not as quick as uh, Judy's ch quick change act here. From officer to civilian in a matter of seconds. Or does Nick have some sort of magic powers that suddenly change people's clothes? Would that be a cool power to have? I'm not sure it would, to be honest. Bit weird, actually. Could you imagine that if you could change someone's clothes with just, like, a wave of your hand? Why? Oh, God. I've just pictured Gok Wan just ru <laughs> running through the streets, waving his hand about changing people's clothes, like, nah, -uh, honey, that ain't gonna cut it. Whoosh, wave of a hand. <laughs> Suddenly everyone is the best dressed people in the world. <laughs> Actually, if anyone was going to have a power like that, it should be. It should probably be Gok Wan. Or a, there's probably other people who are good with fashion. I don't know. Gok Wan's the first bloke who came to mind. <laughs> well, um. Thanks for being here with um this thanks for um not giving up on me part way through uh, I'll tell you I nearly did if you want to see more of this oh, I, I don't know kind of thing again let me know um Watch the movie? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Watch the movie. It's a great movie. The games about it so far haven't been that great. Other than that, I guess I'm going to leave this video here. And I'll see you all next time. Bye bye Look at the sad face. Look upon it. Look upon what you have done to this poor soul. Kissy, 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 kissy. What happens if I get caught? Oh no, game over. Our love can never be. <laughs> it's one of those really stupid flash games. Oh God. And uh, the first thing that comes up when I clicked on it mm -hmm. was games for girls. And I'm like, okay, that's, that's an interesting start. Where are you going with this? And the first part was a puzzle. You know, just a simple, put the pieces where they need to be. And already it's quite a simple puzzle. And then I click on a piece to move it to somewhere. And it immediately shows me exactly where it's supposed to go anyway. Because heaven forbid a girl would have to put a little bit of mind power into something. Because clearly they're not capable of that. And then I've got this thing where I've got to find the Easter eggs. Can you tell me where the eggs are? I know, it's difficult, isn't it? They're really well hidden. It's hilarious how stupid this is. This is the most sexist piece of shit I've ever seen in my entire life.